Are you there, Charlie Bear? Charlie? Will you help me call him? Ready? Are you there, Charlie Bear? Oh, there you are. It's a very red and shiny pair of wellies you're wearing, Charlie. Oh, yes, they look lovely. Whoops! <laughs> Do your wellies look even better from down there? So, um, why are you wearing wellies indoors, Charlie? You're a cow jumper. No. A cow rusher? Oh, you're being a farmer. What else are you going to do on your farm, Charlie? Farmers just jump in muddy puddles, Charlie. Being a farmer is harder work than that. Excellent splashing, Charlie. Wow! What a big farm you've got, Charlie. And there are a lot of muddy puddles in it, too. Maybe I was wrong about being a farmer. It does look like a lot of fun. Splish. Splash. Splosh. Which one is the biggest puddle, Charlie? That's huge. One, two, three. Oh, ooh, what was that? Have a closer look. It's not the tree making that noise, Charlie. Rivet is one of your sheep, Farmer Charlie, and he's stuck up that tree. I think you have to rescue Rivet the sheep before you can do any more puddle jumping, Charlie. Getting a ladder? A trampoline? I didn't know that's how farmers get their sheep out of trees. Oh. <laughs> well done, Farmer Charlie. Hold on. What's that sound? Surely it's not Rivet the Sheep in trouble again. It's Caramel. I think she might be hungry, Charlie. Are you getting some nice green grass? Cows love eating grass. Or a cupcake. Yes, I suppose cows might like cupcakes. Oh! <laughs> is still hungry. Where did you get that cupcake, Charlie? Watch out, Farmer Charlie. Caramel has gone cupcake crazy. Uh-oh. Oh, dear. Niblet's hutch is broken. Now you need to repair Niblet's hutch, Charlie. Well done, Farmer Charlie. Farmer Charlie? I think they all want 
to play puddle jumping with you. I'm not surprised you're tired, Charlie. Being a farmer was a lot of hard work after all. It's amazing what you can do with your imagination. Uh, Charlie, there are muddy welly prints to clean up. <laughs> yes, now! Farmers always clean up after themselves. Hey, that looks like fun too! <laughs> bye bye, little Charlie Bear. Bye bye, everybody. Are you there, Charlie Bear? Where is he? Will you help me call him? Ready? Are you there, Charlie Bear? There you are, Charlie! What are you making? It's a trophy, isn't it? Fantastic! You must have done something extra special to get a trophy. What did you do? Oh, you didn't do anything. Don't worry, Charlie. How about doing something extra special now? <laughs> I've seen you do star jumps before. Do you think that was extra special? Imagination. Are you a are you a, are you a monster? Okay, you're not a monster. Uh, are you being chased by a monster? Sorry, didn't mean to scare you. You're driving a car. It's the Little Charlie Bear Supercar Race! You are imagining that you are a racing car driver. This is extra special. Which car will you race, Charlie? The red one. Good choice. Solid choice, Charlie. Always go red. Drivers, take your places for the Little Charlie Bear Supercar Race! What can you see through your telescope, Charlie? Ah, trophies. You have to race to get a trophy, Charlie. Drivers, get ready! Get steady! Go! 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 Charlie, go! The wind-up key. That's so nice and helpful of them. Go on, Charlie! Look out, Charlie! Whoa, watch where you're driving, Charlie! Whoa! Whoa! Good driving, Charlie Bear! Really good! Catching up to nibble it. Slow down for the bump, Charlie. Charlie? Now you're catching.
catching caramel in the blue car. Your car needs winding up again. How are you going to cross the finishing line now, Charlie? The wind-up key. Charlie, shouldn't you wind Niblet in Caramel's cars too? Hmm? Well done, Charlie. That's extra special helping out your friends. Ready, steady, go! An extra special effort to complete the little Charlie Bear supercar race! Well done, Charlie Bear. You got your trophy. Fantastic racing car, Charlie. Wow! It's amazing what you can do with your imagination. <laughs> Steady, Charlie. Oh, dear. I think you should tidy up your toys, don't you, Charlie? Even if you do have a trophy, you still have to tidy up. Thank you, Charlie. Bye-bye, little Charlie Bear. See you again soon. Are you there, Charlie Bear? Charlie? Oh. Will you help me call him? Ready? Are you there, Charlie Bear? There you are, Charlie. Hey! What are you doing? You've made Midge into a marionette puppet. Fantastic! What else can Midge do, Charlie? Oh, is he getting tired? How do you think you can wake him up a bit, Charlie? Charlie, be careful. I don't think Midge would like to wake up that way. You reckon that Midge does like being flung about the place? But imagine if someone was making you do something like that. Wouldn't be much fun, would it? You do think it would be fun. Hmm. I'm not sure I agree with you, Charlie. Charlie, you're a real marionette puppet on stage and everything. Wow, amazing dancing, Charlie. Bravo, Charlie, bravo. No time for another bow. Looks like your next performance is going to start now. <gasps> uh, Charlie, doesn't look like you're ready for some of those dance moves. Are you sure you're OK? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Those were the biggest horizontal and vertical dance moves I've ever seen. Oh, you don't know what horizontal and vertical means? 
Well, horizontal means sideways or, <laughs> yes, side to side. Good. And vertical, well, vertical means up... <laughs> yes, up and down, exactly. Whew. You're finished for the moment. Right. Uh, bravo, Charlie, I think. What's wrong, Charlie? Oh! You need to go to the toilet. <laughs> Oh, my goodness! You're being pulled back! Oh, no, Charlie, you're being made to dance again! Oh, Charlie, this is terrible! You have to keep trying to get there! Go on, Charlie! You can do it! You can! You have to get to that toilet! Oh, no! That's it, Charlie. Keep trying. Now what are you going to do? You're free! And now you're doing what you want. Good for you, Charlie. It's amazing what you can do with your imagination. Midge will be pleased to have those strings taken off. Did Midge say something, Charlie? Oh, that's nice, Charlie. Is that to make him nice and comfortable? You would do anything for Midge, wouldn't you, Charlie? Of course you would. Bye-bye, little Charlie Bear. Bye-bye, Midge. Bye-bye, everybody.